North Korea could be paralyzed by blackout bomb as Kim Jong-un makes nuclear threats. South Korean officials have confirmed they are well on the way to developing a graphite bomb capable of shutting down the North's power grid and wreaking chaos across the country. The bomb would shut down Kim's hopes of waging war by coating electrical facilities in carbon graphite filaments as part of a precision strike on the Hermit Kingdom a South Korean military spokesman said. All technologies for the development of a graphite bomb led by the Agency for Defense Development have been secured. It is in the stage where we can build the bombs anytime. The so-called soft bomb would only target electrical facilities, not causing any direct harm to the North's estimated 25.3 million citizens. It comes as North Korea warned it would not flinch from the road to bolstering up the nuclear forces unless the US backed down from its hostile and threatening policy towards Pyongyang. The Hermit Kingdom's permanent representative to the United Nations said the US and Donald Trump should take the lead in rolling back nuclear doctrines of aggressive nature such as preemptive strike. A report from state-sponsored news agency KCNA claimed the U.S. was solely responsible for the war of words with North Korea and suggested America should be first to dismantle its own nuclear arsenal. It also warned North Korea would not flinch an inch from continuing to bolster its own nuclear weapons development program should the U.S. continue with what Pyongyang perceives to be a hostile policy. The report read, to all intents and purposes, the nuclear issue on the Korean peninsula was spawned and developed into the present phase today because of the U.S. and, accordingly, the blame for it is entirely on the U.S. The DPRK will neither put the nukes and ballistic rockets on negotiating table in any case nor flinch even an inch from the road to bolstering up the nuclear forces chosen by itself unless the US hostile policy and nuclear threat to the DPRK are fundamentally eliminated. Should the US ignore the repeated warnings and pounce upon the DPRK with military force at last? The DPRK will inflict severe punishment with its power of self-reliance and self-development it has so far consolidated. The KCNA went on to accuse the US of exaggerating the potential conflict between Washington and Pyongyang, suggesting its push for tougher sanctions was disguising the issue as one between the DPRK and UN rather than what the USA.